While we don't know the exact motive yet for today's shooting, we do know what happened inside a crowded space packed with students. So what can people do if they can't escape and are forced to fight back? Five on your side's Daniel Wynn is live in Fenton with some answers. Well, good evening, guys. Yeah, classes like these here in Fenton are a result of the harsh reality we live in. Now, we all know to run, hide, or fight. Fighting being the last result. Folks here hope you never have to, but it is the harsh reality we live in today. I'm redirecting that line of fire off my body. Steve Scalzi is with Krav Maga, a self-defense and training company in Fenton. I'm gaining control. I'm striking my attacker. He's the only He's Krav Maga certified no black belt in Missouri. A far cry from the kid he grew up being. Well, I was, grew up, you know, overweight and bullied as a kid and uh, wanted to not be bullied anymore. That's so. why he made it his mission to train everyone from kids to grandparents how to react, whether they're being attacked, or a gun is pointed at you know, them. What we call like a live side and a dead side. I can redirect this way, come in, boom, strike, 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 and then create distance. So I, I, I like to teach people to use the weapon as a tool. This is a training video from his gym. While this video mainly shows adults, he says kids can benefit from this training as well and encourages parents to consider signing them up. Um, and our goal again is just to give people a little bit more confidence to get them some training to where if they are in that situation where they can do something to help save lives, uh, we want to do that. And while most of us hope we or our children will never be faced with a situation like this, he says classes like these can make a difference and hopefully save a life. I always hate to say that, you know, as the world gets worse, we get busier. And so he tells me uh, they aren't just catering to professionals and professional organizations anymore. They're seeing a lot of younger clients, a lot of parents bringing their kids into places like this because they want them to overall just be prepared. Reporting live in Fenton, Daniel Wynn, five on your side.